What's up guys, it's Super Craft Hearts to the Sick Expo Vicious here, and today we're going to be beta testing Cyber Ghost uh, 6. And no, I did not just like rename it. So, like, I could rename this to Cyber Ghost Over 9000, but I didn't because I actually downloaded to Cyber Ghost 6. As you're going to see by this browser extension, I, I hate it that it's not like here. Do you know how easy that was to access? Not to go to hidden icons. Actually, yeah, see? Right here. Um, so, of course, the developers, uh, they hit me up again, and they said, yo, bro, do you want to test out, um, do you want to test out CyberGhost 6? And I was like, yeah, man. So, here it is. Um, I'm really liking this. Like, the design, everything. And it comes with the same the same features that mobile version has, but I didn't go over it too much. I just really needed like the most updated proxy possible. Um, obviously, you have um, let's see. All right, so I was using secure Wi-Fi hotspot, which is what you have right there, which is the standard, you know, military AES two five six encryption that you get. You also got Surf Anonymously, which is the exact same thing as on the mobile version. Unblock websites, I am not sure what that is, actually. Uh, when we say we unblock content, we really mean it. With CyberGhost, you get access to the largest curated list of unblock, of unblock websites. We verify them every day in order to make sure they are working when you need to access them. Alright, I love these pictures. These are great artists. We optimize our service according to your specific needs. Do you know a website which is not on our list? Just add it. And if there are any, or if there are many users who did the same, we'll start optimizing our service for that website too. All right, so continue. All right. All right. I was like, I'm, I'm sorry if you hear some like static. I'm trying to text my friend to like go away because you, he wants me to make a mixtape for him, and I have a mixer on my desktop. Besides that, <laughs> okay, so, oh, that's a basic standard, you can unblock websites and stuff, but most of these, you know, I have these unblocked, so it doesn't really matter. Um, let's check advanced, I didn't see this. How do I do that? I really want to try out download anonymously, I don't know what that would be. That would stop responding? Shit. What do they do? Did I do something bad? Did I do bad? I did something bad. Oh, 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 okay. Okay, advanced VPN. Oh, oh, okay. So this is just changing stuff. All right. Um, I actually have to change in specifically to United States. My school has actually a very good um, security setup. Ah, oh, oh, premium free. Okay. Oh, dude, this was. Oh, this is so useful, like, just connecting to a specific server, that is amazing. Did you know that every two seconds brings an identity? Uh, let's just see um, how we do. Um, server name, country, time protected, alright, and again, an IP address, which is new. I, I really like this style, it makes me feel like 1337. Uh-huh. Alright, okay, so it blocks malicious content, block ads, block online tracking, HTTPS everywhere. <gasps> no! Dude, that comes as a free service? Dude, that's awesome! HTTPS everywhere, you can't get this on the 5th, you can only get this on the 6th. 5th. With a TH and a TH. Dude, I I'm just like... You look like mini Voldemort. I swear, a cyber ghost and mini Voldemort. I can even see the. You can see it. You can see the little square box where they inputted the PNG file. I mean, seriously, match tones. All right, I can see this. Nobody else probably sees this, but I do. See hidden IP. All right, so my current IP is that. Oh yeah, I'm piggybacking several IPs. So I uh, would actually you get two IPs with. Um, cyber ghost. I'm pretty sure that's how it works. You get this public IP, then you get a subnet mask, not a subnet mask, 
you get a second encrypted IP, which is this one right here. Um, but I have another one, which is a piggybacking IP that I have on on a ghost. Um, I guess you can call me a ghost hacker. I, I think that's what you're supposed to call me. I don't know. But I'm piggybacking off another person's IP when they come uh, streaming onto my uh, my download path. Uh, then I have my regular IP, so I guess I'm pretty good. I just want to see HTTPS everywhere. That is sick. Alright, so I'm just going to cut off the connection, but I don't even use this every single time. Day. Like that's awesome. That's that's great. All right. Uh, download anonymously. Be protected when downloading. CyberGhost creates a safe environment for downloading the content you desire. More speed for you. CyberGhost gives you access to the full power of our server database. Try it. You may find that speed on your servers is better than the one then provided by your ISP. Yeah, that's probably true. ISP needs to get the bandwidth caps. Uh, oh yeah, I need to get premium in order to, but how do I get premium? I don't understand. Uh, don't, uh, start an additional program, don't start an open default browser, I can remember that, start an additional, start on an MS downloading. Oh, dang, did you know that 84% of countries don't care about the protection of privacy when communicating online? CyberGhost corrects that. So that's very good upload and download speeds. Damn. It's like, now I want to try downloading something. Like how would that work? That's actually really great. I love the feature for anonymous downloading. I want to see if there's any bugs. Hmm. Just. Alright, uh, alright, so just, it's still connecting, so, yeah. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Taking longer than usual to connect. Alright, my DNS server settings are changing, so that means... All right. Okay. This has taken a very long time to connect. What's going on? All right. Oh, so I still got um. I still get protection, so that's cool. Uh, Alright, I got good download speeds. Alright, I'm gonna try and download something right now. Let's go on Chrome. Uh, a little CyberGhost 6 right there. And let's try and download. This. Right, let's want something that we could download. Um, let's download. Download an image off 4chan. Yeah. Oh god. I'm probably gonna get sued. I'm probably gonna get age verification on this, and then some little kid's gonna be traumatized for life. Oh my god. Dude. Alright, okay. I'm gonna download this image, because it's the first thing on the 4chan board. So, fuck all of you. Alright, save image as... Actually, that's not good enough. Save image as... Fucking download speeds in my ass. Download a fucking image. Actually, that's like... That's like, really fast. Like, it didn't even... Oh, wow. Alright, um, let's try downloading something in, like, bulk. Let's try going to SourceForge. What, what, what could we download on SourceForge that could give us something? Actually, you know, forget it. I'm gonna take CyberGhost's word for that. Like, when I need it. 
all use. But it's great because I thought it was just um, um, downloading uh, anonymously via your server IP. So whatever. Let's see what else? What other features do you have? Bypass censorship. I actually want to try that out. Break free from any form of censorship. So I go to fights for a free internet for everybody. This profile will get access to Facebook, Twitter, YouTube, and anything that's just blocking your country. That's it. That's it. Give to you a free uncensored internet. Bypassing censorship is and will remain forever free. Oh, cool. You know that the um, that, 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 that's great. That's great. Bypassing censorship will remain free. Net neutrality rules. Yeah. You know that every two seconds bring a new identity theft victim. Cyberghost protects your integrity. All right. It's just, it's like, that's actually really cool that you will give bypass censorship as a free option. That's really great. Alright. I love, I love this fucking thing, CyberGhost 6 connected. Thing. That's, that, that's awesome. Alright, uh, that's okay. Um, I haven't logged into my account because I know you uh, cinches get my stitches. What did I just say? Um, let's see, download anonymously. I'm going to have my advanced thing on, but right now. But seriously, it's a it's a really good VPN. I mean, I'd recommend this to everyone. You can also customize it in settings. Oh yeah. Well, automatically start during startup. Always remember the latest settings used. Actually, turn it off. Turn on that. Okay. Exceptions. No, no exceptions. Connection. Uh, use TCP instead of UDP connections. Yes, please. Uh, Wi-Fi app protection. Enable app protection. Uh, nah, I'm okay. I use unprotected EXE files every single day, so. I'm just going to close that, and you open it on hidden icons, and you can open it right here, and maximize, and everything is okay. Alright, so I guess now I'm just going to open the advanced settings and connect to a server. This is really cool. Um, I'll probably rate this application on a um, 10 out of 10 basis, just because it has all the things that are like, um, a for HTTPS, and um, being able to select the custom servers that you want, especially um, a bypass censorship, having that as a free service, that's like really cool of CyberGhost to do. I love their net neutrality opinion uh, on everything, really, so that's great. Um, 10 to 10, um, some suggestions I'd probably give is um, having a hidden icon on the top of the taskbar for Windows or um, GNU Linux users. Or I think it's just Windows that uses that. I haven't used Linux in like a long time. Yeah, whatever. I haven't used Linux in a long time. I use Kali Linux, but that was originally Backtrack, so I guess it doesn't count. Not yet, anyways. But besides that, um, besides that, great VPN and uh, um, best wishes. So um, thank you guys for watching. Have a super cat, hard, just like extra others just day. Boop.